Hi again, my name is Miss Dyer, and I serve students whose last names begin with the letters S through Z. I also have a great pleasure of being the Advanced Placement Coordinator, or an AP Coordinator, for Finley High School. So today I'm going to talk to you a little bit about the, our Advanced Placement Program. So basically, I did some questions that you might have um, about AP or Advanced Placement. First of all, AP is a program that offers college level courses and exams that um, students can take in high school. Right now, FHS currently offers 11 AP courses and two AP exam only courses. And the AP exam only courses mean that um, the students don't necessarily um, study the class or the course um, through AP but they take an exam at the end of the course because they feel they're prepared to do that um, through actually a College Credit Plus program. Um, taking AP courses in high school could give students an advantage in college by letting them, you can earn college credit, you can earn advanced placement, um, it helps you to save money and time, and it also having that AP on your transcript um, allows you to stand out to colleges also. AP is recognized and is a recognized brand or a recognized course offerings throughout the United States. Um, it's been in existence for a long time now and it's, it is highly looked at um, as, a, as a very good thing. So what can students expect when taking an AP class? Um, basically, it's going to be the same rigor as a college class. It's going to be fast-paced, extensive, and the breadth and the depth, and it's going to have lengthy reading passages and writing responses required daily. Um, students can plan on having about 10 hours a week of work for an AP class. So it's, it's pretty rigorous. Um, all subjects are pretty rigorous as far as classes are concerned. Um, why take an AP class? What's, what's the purpose? Basically, um, AP says that they would help to have students get higher scores on college entrance exams, hopefully. Um, it also gives a stronger chance for students to be accepted into the college of their choice. It also um, allows students to have enhanced chances of being awarded competitive scholarships. And let's say that your student or you as a student are interested in taking an AP course for the following year. Um, when you're scheduling for next year, which usually starts in about January, um, students should get a recommendation from their current teacher of the subject that they want to take the AP class in. Um, on their course request, request form that everybody has, um, the student should sign up for the AP class they want to take and then have their current teacher sign that form also stating that they recommend this AP class for that student. So that's kind of how you get involved in AP class um, classes. I'm going to advance here. All right, a couple bit more information about advanced placement. Um, first of all, AP exams. You may hear about AP exams. Um, it's a very important aspect of the AP courses. Students can earn college credit or advanced placement in college by taking an AP exam at the end of the course. The AP exam costs around $90 per exam and it's produced, this whole program is actually produced through and by the College Board. Um, students can opt out of taking the exam and still take the class but just decide not to take the exam at the end. Although if they do decide this, um, it does not guarantee that they will earn college credit or advanced placement in college. It's going to be really important when students go to college to mention and also probably have a copy of their scores to show the college so that they know what kind of um, scores they got on your AP on the AP exams, but also what kind of AP AP courses they took. Um, and then on, on this other side here, we're we talk about, we have actually 
11 courses offered at Finley High School and then those two exam only courses. There are other subjects that people can take AP exams in that are not, the courses actually are not offered at Finley High School, but if the person wants to do an independent study in one of the subjects or they take an AP class online, they are more than welcome to sign up for the exam and take the exam at Finley High School. So you'll see that we have a wide variety of AP courses offered, um, some in art, we have some in science. The actual two, the two science ones are CCP courses, but a lot of the students double up um, and take the exam at the end of the year. Um, we do have two English classes, English language and composition, which is mainly for 11th graders and AP English Literature and Composition, which is for 12th graders. Um, we have AP European History. We also offer several foreign languages AP classes, so AP Latin and AP Spanish Language and Culture. Um, we have AP Microeconomics, which takes place of the economics credit that every student needs. Um, we have Statistics, Calculus, and then two in the social studies, actually three with, a, with AP microeconomics, but two other ones in the social studies realm, and that's AP U.S. government and politics, which would take care of the government um, credit that every student needs. And then the AP U.S. history, which is mainly for 10th graders, because that's usually when students take U.S. history, um, that's also offered. And that's one of the earliest um, AP classes that we offer, a lot of these are junior and senior level courses. So if at any time, besides just talking to the teachers of your current subjects who can explain maybe a little bit more about the AP exams or, they, or AP exams and courses, um, they could also point you in the direction of the teacher that teaches those classes so you could talk to them too about it. But you could also feel free to email me or um, stop by and I can try to give you as much information as possible. Um, I do know like the overall aspect of the AP courses because I am the AP coordinator. So um, again, I'm Miss Dyer and you can email me or just stop by my office in the counseling office if you have any questions about AP in general. Thank you very much.